Hi, this is Graham Helfrich, Technical Advisor Manager for the Engineering Software here at IHS Market. Welcome to the weekly Did You Know episode where we learn how to do something of value that you probably didn't know about your IHS Market engineering software. Today, we're going to look at how you can easily get your well forecasts from Harmony into your reserve software like Aries, Velnav, PHDWIN, and Mosaic to do the economics for your reserves. Now, most companies will use Harmony to do all their engineering work and their production forecasting. And at the same time, they'll license a dedicated economics program like Aries, Velnav, PHDWIN, or Mosaic, again, to perform the economics and the reserves by taking those production forecasts from Harmony. And because of the advantages Harmony has to do both type well work and decline work, we've created dedicated exports in Harmony to each of these reserve software. And that's going to make the process a lot easier for you. Now a quick flashback, there's actually about two reasons uh, why you would want to get your forecast from Harmony into your reserve software. One of them is if you're doing standard decline analysis work on dozens or thousands of wells. In this case, I actually suggest checking out my episode number 11, where you can learn to use Harmony to automate declines on a thousand wells in under nine minutes. The other reason that you might want to send your forecast from Harmony to your reserves program is to leverage physics-based forecasts from a numerical reservoir model. So in episode number four, you can check out how to convert a reservoir model forecast into an ARPS forecast for the purpose of reserves reporting. So again, if either of these topics sound of interest to you, uh, I'm going to include the direct links to each of these episodes in the comments section of this LinkedIn post. All right, on to the process. So here I am in Harmony Enterprise. I've got about a thousand wells. I've already automated declines so we can go and see that each well indeed has a decline and it has a forecast. All right, so let's get this out into Aries. The first thing I might want to do is, is say that what is the well identifier that I want Aries to recognize a well as when I do this export? Maybe it is API. If that's the case, the first thing we might want to consider is going to your attributes, turning on your display name format, and you can change this to, for example, API. And you could do that for all the wells if you want, the way you can do this in a bulk way pick all the wells, make the first one API, and you can even just copy that, pick the rest of the rows, paste. Okay, so that way we see that all the wells are named with their API, and this will carry forward into your Aries export. Okay, so we're going to go export this button here. This is the location. You can save this file, and these are the different reserves or economic software that you can pick. Let's start with Aries. Okay, if you have multiple declines, maybe one from April, May, maybe you've got a conservative one, maybe you have a condensate or oil forecast, this is where you can pick which analyses you're actually trying to export. Okay, and we just saved it. Let's go check it out. Okay, so here's the Aries text file that we just created. We can open it up and we see the API name for each well. We see those decline parameters and we see the analysis name. So you can do this for one well, or you could do this for a thousand wells in one batch. Okay, so that's Aries, really easy. Next, let's check out Valnav. Okay, now with Valnav, there's a bit of a tip. It says Valnav or Energy Navigator requires a reserves classification in order to use this. So we can go, for example, look at a well, and if we haven't already, we can assign a reserves classification to the well like I have with this one here. So Valnav, export, there is our decline. Okay, open up that file that we've just created specifically for Valnav, and this is in the format which you can bulk import to Valnav from Harmony Enterprise. So again, doing all your declines, your type wall work, keeping it in Harmony, and then leveraging the economic software of Valnav. Okay, what else do we have here? 
do an export to PHD win. Actually, I think I might pick a few more wells here. There we go. PHD win. Okay, so this is a table and this is in the format which PHD win can import. So we've got the well name or API number, the decline parameters. So again, you can bulk import this, do your economics on these forecasts in PHD win. I think the last one is going to be mosaic. Okay, so another table, but a different format, okay? But what does this really mean for you? Well, like I mentioned, if you know that Harmony is quicker and easier to do this decline and type will work, but you still need to use your reserve software to perform those economics, now you can have the best of both worlds using the exports that we've covered here. Uh, the next thing that this can mean for you is if you want to get your physics-based RTA forecast into your reserves software, now you're able to. And again, episode number four will show you those steps about fitting a B value to your numerical model forecast. Now one kind of related topic is if you want to import all of your ARIES forecasts into Harmony, that's completely possible and it'll just take a minute. So you can check out episode number 14 to see how to do this. And that's it. Thank you so much for your time. If you have any questions, reach out to me by phone or email and subscribe to be notified of next week's Did You Know episode.